Hey everybody, Larry Lawton here. I got a great, great GTA video. I saw this somebody else play it, but I'm gonna go over it. I'm gonna play it myself. Should be kind of fun. And we're gonna start playing more and more GTA. Before I get started, check us out. YouTube member programs, Patreon, all those places we're gonna be doing a lot more. Check out my book, Gangster Redemption. You guys know it. It's right here. Gangster Redemption, man. So let's have some fun with this one, guys. Franklin went to Michael's house. Guy goes flying off the balcony. What the fuck is going on? Look at it. It was a misunderstanding. She fucked a prick in my bed. Did you hear what he just said, Michael? You fucked a prick in my bed. She actually did it in the house. Now, listen. Remember I told you guys what's morally right and what's illegal and all that? That's not morally right. Obviously, I don't know their relationship or anybody's relationship. I don't think anybody should get this wild over a girl or a guy, and no matter what we're talking about. You know why? Takes two to tango, everybody. Just don't ever forget that. It takes two to tango. Always. So, if you're the husband and your wife's fucking around, yeah, you can get mad at the guy, like he is, but you remember your wife fucking did it too. And if you're a girl and your guy's fucking around, remember the girl did it too and your husband did it, or a boyfriend or whatever you wanna talk about. I don't take any stock in that because I don't worry about that kind of shit. I have zero jealousies in me and stuff like that, so I just, I just play that shit and let it go. Let's keep going on this one. This is gonna be good. Bullshitting. It wasn't like that. She's she's here. It wasn't like that. The guy's in the bed with her naked, and now she says, "Don't kill him." Oh, look at this little butt. <laughs> oh, now she's mad. Okay, they okay. They gotta go. They're going to chase the tennis guy. Oh, 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 shit! Come on, Larry. Oh, that's the way somebody would drive if 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 they, if they were pissed. Okay. You know, back in the hood, I thought you wanted to get this motherfucker. Oh, look at this. We're chasing the tennis pro. Yeah, I'm a cuckold, a snob, and a fucking cliche. All right, we're ch chasing the tennis pro. And he's going crazy! That, that tennis pro would be shitting his pants if someone was really chasing him. Because these people, you know, listen to me, I've been around a lot with women and shit, and, and, and they're crazy too. But no, I read husbands. I don't believe in that. You know, it takes two to tango in anything you do. I. Right. Okay. Whoa! Whoa! Oh, come on, man! Oh, come on, man. I, I'm sorry. I, 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 I'm. This is what happens. People are stuck. Here I go. I got it. We're chasing. We got stuck there in a little bit, but that's okay. That's Larry's driving. All right, look, we're, we're, we're looking for this guy now. Now what do you do? You're looking for somebody. Now you're just looking at everybody's house. Man, I've done that. Look for people that just because something happened with a business deal, you know, with, with something that was illegal and robbing. So now we're just checking this neighborhood out is what we're doing. Look at this. Looks like a nice neighborhood. Look, he's going down. We're going down this side road. one of these fucking houses. Yeah, keep your eye out. Oh, look at this. This looks nice. Oh, the guy's car. Look at this. Look, he's up on the top. Oh, man. He is. Hey, asshole. You ran off before we could settle our debts. Michael, fine. You got the wrong idea, man. Oh, really? You got the wrong idea, Michael? The world owes him a living. Uh-oh. Now, look at this. He's up on the top. You know where he lives. You come back at a better time. Oh, look at this house. He wants to pull this deck down. Man, you really gonna be this fucking dramatic? Exactly. Franklin is right. There's a logical one there. Look at this guy naked. This is so funny. Oh my god. Oh, he's really talking tennis. That's a slap in my face. I'd have beat the fuck out of him just for that. Maybe I should come up there and practice my backhand. Absolutely. Bud, your negative energy is serious. Oh, that guy runs away, gets thrown out of the bed, and then he's bitching. Oh, look at this shit. Oh, look at this. Are you fucking kidding me? Oh, he's pissed. Oh, look at this girl. Say that was uncool, bud. My bad. My bad. My bad for fucking my wife. Oh my god. Oh my god. He's got to be so pissed off, man. Dude. And we'll see how you like it when someone fucks with your shit. Well, hey, now he's trying to pull. Oh, he's gonna pull that down. That's what I saw. I do remember when he did that. Look at this. Get in the truck. This could never happen. 
you know, this little truck could pull those beams down. I don't think they'd have the thing. But but let's let, 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 let's crank it. Look at this. This is pretty cool though. He's pulling this down. Imagine this shit really happening. Could you imagine if it was this easy? People out there in the real world would do this. Man, look at this. Look at this. Oh! Oh! This fucking house goes down! Fucking that whole thing! How many people is it gonna kill anyway? I mean, think of that too. How many people are gonna get killed in this fucking thing? Oh my fucking god, look at this. They got great graphics in this GTA, man. Look at the talk about now. Where is he? Is he dead? You know, the people in that house, I mean, listen to me. I never believed in that. I wasn't a murderer like that, you know? Maybe you'll keep it on the court and out of my wife. Oh, this is so fucking funny. Hey, it's a service to the fucking community. Oh, look at this. Go back to Michael's house. All right, let's go. All right, Michael's going back to the house. Incoming call. Santa, what the hell? That's not my house. Bullshit. Oh, bro. I couldn't afford a place like that. I'm a tennis coach. I hit balls. It, it's true on that. I was just hiding there. Give me a pawn. Yo! What, what tennis guy can afford a house like green that? Green light! Green light! Martin Madrazo, give you green light! Uh oh. Oh, I'm scared. Man. Oh, he don't know who he's fucking with. He's crazy, Michael. I like him for that. Green light, green light. Oh, this is so good. I'm getting to know the city a little bit. Understanding, you know. Martin Madrasso? That's what she said. Hey, dude's a kingpin, homie. And you better hope. I ain't hoping anything. Chick was hysterical. Chill out. Hey, man, that's a mean looking motherfucker. Oh, shit. Uh oh, they're chasing me. Now they're fucking chasing me. They're shooting at me. Oh, you gotta turn around and fight him. And you don't got no gun on you? Man, Michael. Look at this. Look at oh! Oh! Michael, you gotta be quick. Yeah, there you go. Shoot! 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 Oh, fuck. Shoot! He's right. I had to kill him. Man, this truck's moving, man! Oh no! Keep it going. See, Michael as the kingpin in the area, or a guy in crime like that, he would know every player in the area, if you know what I mean. He would know everybody. So, I, I'm not buying that part of it. Okay, we gotta, I gotta turn around and get home. Get to Michael's house. Where's Michael's house? Let me look. Okay, where's Michael's house? Okay, I gotta go turn around. Let me try to turn around. Okay, go back to my house think about There you go. Look at this car all boarded up and everything else. Michael's done. I love that when there's no cops in an area, though. <laughs> you know? Uh-oh! Oh! See, he knows. Franklin knows. Michael would know that, everybody. There's no way a guy who's pulling heights like that, doing everything like that, wouldn't know who the big guys in the area are. Nobody would know that. Some hot women there. You are wasted sitting by that fucking pool, man. You're right. I need to do something. Now, listen, they just knocked down. Who knows who died? Who knows that? They've been shot up by some Mexican cartel. And he's talking about going back to work. Man, nobody's that cool. You'd be scared shit right now or figuring out how to do shit. Oh, shit. Taking some score. There was a time. That was all I did. Well, no, I could tell you some shit, too. Like what? About the city I was born and raised in. I think about it. Yeah. Now, the, I know the real Franklin was a badass. I interviewed him on my channel. If you haven't seen that in, uh, uh, video, you got to go up here and look for Franklin. We also did Lester. So we did a few of them. Uh, we're getting home. Getting to safety, I call it. All right, get home. Oh, fuck my own gate up. Close that gate, man. Close that gate. Close it. All right. We're home. We're safe. Ooh. Ooh. 
Oh. Hey, thanks for the help out there today, kid. I had no idea it was gonna get that hot. Shit, pulling houses off the hillside, show has a way to win. Try pulling a house off the hillside. Michael's got this mansion, so, and I don't get. Oh shit, I think we're about to find Wait a minute. How did they get in? They left the gate open? Who would do that? Do you know who I am? Do you know uh -oh. who I am? Do you? No. Do you? You? I think so. Good. I know who you are. I know where you live. Who are you? I'm Frank. Why would you give your real license. name? Oh, he tells ask for his license. Oh my god. Look at these guys. I love them. No. They wouldn't no. have bats. They'd have guns, number one. Maybe help Mr. DeSanta here. Well. Listen, Franklin knows he's the big drug deal. But I can guarantee you, Michael's got to know. Man, Mr. Madrazo... It, Mr. Madrazo is a legitimate businessman who was wrongfully accused of running a Mexican-American gang and a narcotic ring. Did you, the charges were dropped because of the witnesses. Did you like the way Franklin explained who this Madrazo was in front of him? That was really a slick move, not because you're not rat now, no matter what. And whether the guy would have gave a shit or not is another thing. But that was a really slick move. I, I really picked up on that, saying, oh, how we beat it and everything else. Of course, the witnesses disappear. Uh, that, listen, that shit's real. That really is real. Let's keep it going. This came up missing. Now, now, he's got these young guys. But they would have, they would definitely have guns, first of all, all over. But, oh! Michael gets popped. Did you oh, look at him. I like. Stop that. I like a boss or a, a, a cartel that's willing to do the work himself. This guy ain't playing around. This is fucking doing the work yourself. You're hitting him back. You're not saying to someone, you hit him. You fucking do it themselves. Obviously, that doesn't happen, really. Uh, the, the guy's fucking got the order to kill him from fucking Colombia or wherever. But. Look at this. Hillside in Vinewood Hills. I thought the owner was banging my wife. Well, that was a strange house for a tennis coach. See? Smart. Strange house for a tennis coach. Clearly. Morons. Natalia will need a hotel while you finance the rebuild. One shit. Finance the rebuild? What is he going to say? No? And I'm guessing here that the rebuild uh, will be somewhere in the 2.5 million range. <laughs> Of course. Great. Now, that drug dealer, if he thought he couldn't pay, that look at the hot nice. broad. Now, let me tell you something how that, that was. First of all, spitting on someone is so much disrespect. Also, slapping somebody, hitting them this way, that's disrespect. You rather punch a guy, a made guy, and well, you don't want to do that like I did, but you don't want to do stupid things. That's more disrespect than a punch, the slap, and, and that's what it is. But now they're telling this super fire and they just leave. First of all, maybe because they're looking at Michael's house. Michael's got a fucking mansion. Obviously the tennis pro and all this, so they got lessons and this and the money and all the bullshit that goes along with that crap. But, so he's thinking, eh, and I know where he is, what is he gonna do anyway, insurance. They don't even give a shit. Come on, man. I like hey, Franklin, right? even the real Franklin. Never better. So what now? Looks like I'm gonna have to postpone my retirement. Fuck. Ah oh, man, I'm mortgaged up to my eyeballs. Look, I only know one way. A lot of people, a lot of gangsters are. I wanted you to hear that say. I want Lester. Oh, he's gonna give Lester a call. Hey, Lester Crest, my main man. I'm gonna have to track him down. Oh my God, Lester. I'm the real boss. Back. Remember that, not Lester. I I, I, I'm the real boss, not Lester. Now, I, I, I want to say something on this end of the thing. You know, obviously, my look at that nice house and all that. Okay. Now, let me stop that part of it. Okay. Passed. First of all, did you see what Michael said? Out of retirement. And, you know, I get that part of it, and I'll tell you why. You know, when, you, when, you, when you're a gangster and you're a guy who did a lot of stuff illegal and you know how to make money illegally, I mean, trust me, guys. I know I could go and make some millions doing what I used to do. I know I could. As bad as that is, I know I could do that. And it, it's crazy because they actually kind of showing right here, hey, I got myself down in a bad way, or money, did this, whatever he did. 
and fucking he can go back into his old ways and make money. I also want you to look at the character of Michael. Michael's temper did that. Now, I played the up to this point. I'm up, this is the point I'm up to. I remember when Michael's temper, when he got the car repossessed and he beat the fuck out of that guy in the shop. That's how he met Franklin and those guys. He always had a temper in this game. Uh, and I don't know where it is. I'm trying to get Michael to, the real Michael, to interview like I did Lester Crest, at, uh, which is Jay Kleitz and Franklin and all the guys like that. And I'm going to try to do every one of the characters as a person. So I like this part of this game. It showed a personal side of, of the game instead of just a robbery and everybody do a robbery. That happens. Shit like that happens. People lose their tempers. People get out of the wrong way because of a uh, pussy or a dick or whatever you want to call it. So that kind of shit can fucking change you, period. I don't care who you are. Uh, and it, it has nothing to do with... Uh, <laughs> Well, it has a lot to do with this. I used to say to people, I says, you know, when I was robbing, we used to go out and we'd be three guys, four four of us total in a car, and we never fought, never fought. We went to hotels, had to stay low, all this, never fought, never did anything. It only happens because these fucking, these morons here, I mean, women sometimes can fuck up everything. Now, in that case, Michael's wife's fucking the tennis pro. I blame Michael's wife, it, it, it you know, Women or relationships can fuck up everything, and I, it's just I, I used to say that. I said it's a shame because when you get four guys together, two guys together, they get along. They watch sports. They do this. They don't watch sports. Whatever they do, never. I used to go on robberies, and I went sightseeing on robberies with guys. Never did we have a fight. Never, ever. We had missions to do. Got it done. All on the same page. Women throw pussy in the fucking mix. A lot goes wrong, and goes the opposite way, you know, I mean, you idiot dicks out there too. So, but this is a great mission. I wanted to do this mission. GTA, I'm back. I know it's older. I'm working through the mode. So that's what I'm doing now. So let's, let's make sure of that happens. Have a great day, everybody. Stay strong, stay safe. Have a great night.